Hey guys, this is your Urge 2 interview the Shingon Lek Lek Avengers Infinity War Infinity Gauntlet. So, this is the build itself right here, and this is how it is uh, packaged. So, this is set 1099-1. So, let's get straight into it. So, before getting into the build, this set does come with uh, some extra Infinity Stones. Uh, so, you have all of them and they are molded just like the how the offshore lego ones are molded and that's definitely great so there's uh four of them of each stone and i took one off uh and some of them too but yeah Aside from that, that's pretty much it for the extra infinity stones. So this is the gauntlet itself right here. And let's start with the gauntlet. So the gauntlet here, you have all six stones. And you can kind of turn it around because uh, it's on a turntable. And you have uh, the soul stone. You have the re reality stone. You have the space, mine, uh, power, and time. The mold for the gauntlet here looks pretty nice. I mean... You know, you know, it looks very accurate, and yeah, uh, there's no problem with it. And uh, for the gauntlet stand itself, you have this design right here, which is not a sticker, it is printed, which is definitely great. Um, it's much better than the original LEGO one, and yeah, I mean, it's pretty cool. And you have uh, some studs at the side, and you have this turntable here. And I do have the offshore LEGO versions of the uh, Space Stone and the Power Stone. So, um, yeah, I mean, they look pretty accurate. Um, the only thing that's different is the color tone of it. Um, yeah, the offshore Lego ones, uh, they are much more lighter, and the Shingyon ones, they are much more darker. And uh, for the Power Stone, it looks, the color here looks uh, almost the same, you know? So that's great. Um, so let's uh, put this gauntlet on Thanos. Um, I have the DQ Thanos here, and Unfortunately, I don't have uh, the offshore Lego Thanos or the Infinity Gauntlet, which does kind of suck. But yeah, so this is how uh, Thanos looks like uh, with the Infinity Gauntlet on him. And yeah, I mean, he looks pretty cool. But aside from that, that's pretty much it for the Infinity Gauntlet. So, over conclusion of this build here, so how do I do it? Well, the quality of this is uh, definitely great, it looks nice, um, it is very accurate to the original version of this, and yeah, uh, for the stones themselves, uh, they also look great, um, it's just that the color tone is uh, slightly altered, but if you don't care about that, then yeah, this is definitely the one for you, but if you want a more colorful version of the stones, um, I suggest uh, you getting the Lily version, but if you want all six stones, then you are better off uh, getting the Shingon one but if you have uh, two of the stones that's not included then yeah I suggest you getting the Lily version and I believe both Shingon and Lily have made the uh, chrome version of the infinity gauntlet so you can get that if you like it and bro, I think this is a pretty nice build um, you know the sticker parts they are printed I think this is great and if you can't afford the original Thanos ultimate battle set uh, and you only want the Infinity Gauntlet, then yeah, I suggest you getting the Shingyong version. So, buy links for a set down in the description box below, along with all my social media pages down in the description. So, if you like my channel, make sure to subscribe right here and watch more videos right here. So, that's it for the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you very soon.